Methodist Dallas Medical Center has reopened to all patients. Sunday night, they started rerouting patients because of a spike in flu cases. They wanted to make sure that they could care for those experiencing an emergency. Well, CBS 11's Brittany Jeffers is live in Fort Worth with what the school district is doing to try to stop the spread of the virus. Brittany. Well, Russ, we found out that Fort Worth ISD is trying to take every precaution to make sure that both the students and the staff are staying healthy after they come back from winter break today. And they say that this all starts with handing out extra hand sanitizer as well as soap. So we are told they're going to be also sending out reminders um, to stay healthy uh, via texts and emails. And they say with the flu cases increasing, Fort Worth ISD is also asking any parents that if they have a student who gets sick to please stay at home and wait 24 hours after his or her fever is gone before returning back to school. When it comes right down to it, it may be that we do have, you know, a lot of absences, but this is at least an attempt to try to minimize that. Now, since last week, about half of the patients at Methodist Urgent Care uh, have shown up with flu-like symptoms. And doctors said that patients spilled over from Methodist Dallas ER, where doctors got overwhelmed. And as you mentioned, they had to start rerouting them. And that was the same story at Baylor and Parkland. Now, doctors are telling us, however, that this strain of flu that's causing the spike can't be avoided by the flu shot. However, they are still encouraging people to get them. They say it is not too late in this season. Live here this morning in Fort Worth, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News.